your skin, Big Vanish. The top acne scarring treatments of 2020. Having to deal with active acne already takes a great deal of effort and takes a large toll on our skin. Yet, the war that is raging on our skin is far from done. After the acne has healed, a pitfall awaits in the form of acne scars which can feel downright diabolical. So, what are acne scars? Well, acne scars are the changes in textures and indentation that occur on a skin as a result of severe acne. Acne scars appear when the acne is gone. The probability of acne scars increases when a person has inflammatory acne that includes acne cysts and nodules, skin pores with excess oil, bacteria, and dead skin cells. Picking, squeezing, or popping acne also increases inflammation, which results in scarring. This later creates a deep break in the wall of the pore. Some infected material may spread into the surrounding tissue. Thus, this creates deeper lesions. In an attempt to repair this, the skin now forms new collagen fibers. Unfortunately, these repairs usually aren't as smooth and flawless as the original skin. This leaves behind what we called acne scars. This leaves permanent or long-lasting effect on our physical, mental, and social well-being. But don't stress out, the good news is that acne scars can be treated. Just as a warning, some of the scar treatments can't be done alongside top typical acne medications, and the inflammation that's caused by breakouts can also reduce treatment effectiveness. Here are the top seven treatments for dealing with acne scars. First up is microneedling. One of the most recommended acne scar treatments is microneedling. This procedure is great for those who want the results of laser skin resurfacing with little to no downtime. This top acne scar treatment is now a popular solution for treating acne scars. Microneedling helps reduce the appearance of your acne scars by breaking down the old tissues and remodeling your skin with a new batch of collagen and elastin fibers. This acne treatment also stimulates collagen production and healing factors. Your collagen is an essential protein that gives your skin a youthful look. Microneedling though is not a quick fix as it involves your skin's regrowth and may take up to several months before you could see drastic results from this treatment procedure. It is an effective, safe procedure that improves your skin appearance as it helps reduce wrinkles, diminish scarring, and tightens or rejuvenates your loose or aging skin. Microneedles that are 1 mm and longer should be performed in an office by professionals since the risk is greater. Home acne scar treatments with a microneedling tool and smaller bristle length can be used, such as the Banisher 2.0. Here are common microneedling tools. Derma Roller. This is the most common microneedling tool, which is full of tiny needles attached to a handle. A lot of derma rollers may come from different brands, but it's best to use or purchase from a trusted brand for you to ensure its quality. Bent needles may tug or cause damage to your skin rather than healing it. A derma stamp like the Banisher 2.0. Needles from a derma stamp enter the skin in a straight manner compared to that of a derma roller, which comes in at a slight 90 degree angle. It is a better tool for you to use should you aim for hard to reach areas such as the sides of your nose. Number two, dermabrasion. Also known as dermaplaning, dermabrasion is a skin resurfacing procedure, a minimally invasive procedure that is considered physical exfoliation and removes the outermost part of skin. This uses a rotating device and sheds off the outer skin layers. This acne scar treatment allows new skin to take place and helps prevent the appearance of facial lines as well as improving acne scars. It can be done either as a standalone treatment or with other cosmetic procedures. This top acne scar treatment leads to a smoother surface of the skin and it helps treat the following conditions sun damaged skin, skin lesions, age spots, acne scars, pockmarks, and scars from accidents or disease, burn scars, aging skin, wrinkles, removal of warts, moles, and skin tags. This kind of acne scar treatment is often performed in the doctor's clinic where medication is administered to the patient and they may also be numbed with some medication before the procedure starts. This top acne scar treatment is recommended for patients with fair skin complexion since performing this treatment on those with darker skin may result in scarring and discoloration. Number three, chemical peels. Another top acne scar treatment would be chemical peels. They use different types of acid which breaks down layers of skin to get rid of any fine lines, wrinkles, and large pores and uneven skin tone. This acne scar treatment also helps tighten the skin, regenerate it, and revitalize it. 
The goal of Chemical Peel is to help achieve a more radiant complexion through exfoliating the old damaged layer of skin off. There are three types of chemical peels. Superficial, medium depth, and deep depth. The superficial type is the most recommended type among the three kinds of chemical peel as it has the mildest effect and requires a minimal downtime. Deeper peels run a larger risk of causing more scarring and they have a longer healing time. Aside from this, superficial chemical peels are less expensive and less painful. However, the setback for this top acne treatment would be the recovery period as it would take 5-7 to seven days for the results to be seen and during the recovery period skin can look very red and raw and even start peeling. You would also need to be very careful to avoid the sun and cover skin with an ointment to protect it. Number 4. Retinoic Acid Retinoic acid is made from vitamin A and found only in prescription creams which help in skin cell turnover and minimizes collagen breakdown. This ingredient has been known to treat acne scars and reduce post-inflammatory pigmentation. Side effects of this top acne scar treatment include peeling, irritation, redness, discomfort, and sensitivity to sun exposure. Retinol is a weaker, over-the-counter version of tretinoin and is highly effective in reversing the damage caused by exposure to the sun's UV rays and signs of aging. Tretinoid, on the other hand, minimizes fine lines, evens out your skin color, improves skin textures and acne scars. Side effects would include intolerance to irritation and dryness. Results can take months of consistent use and retinoids are best used for acne scars due to hyperpigmentation and dark marks rather than pitted or rolling acne scars. Number 5. Lasers Another top acne scar treatment is laser treatment. It helps reduce the appearance of your acne scars and mainly focuses on using light therapy to either help or remove the surface of your skin's outer layer and stimulates the production of new cells as a replacement to the old and damaged cells. Laser treatments are done as an outpatient procedure where a skin specialist moves a laser wand over your skin, removing the damaged skin cells and make the scars disappear, including these types of scars. Injury scars, burn scars, acne scars, dark spots, age spots, and other types of hyperpigmentation. This top acne scar treatment, however, is not recommended when you have light sensitivity due to certain medications as laser treatment involves both heat and light. Your skin specialist may also discourage you from undergoing laser treatment if you're taking blood thinning medications and other sorts of skin conditions including active acne and skin sores. Number six, fillers. Fillers are a less expensive form of acne scar treatment which help give you a younger look. Filler is helpful for treating wrinkles, hollows, and lines and also plumps your cheeks, lips, hands, chin, jaw, lines, and temples. Fillers reduce the appearance of any wrinkles and skin folds around the mouth and nose, even filling the depressed scars and certain areas of the chin. This top acne treatment may be used for non-surgical chin augmentation and non-surgical nose lifts. Derma fillers, on the other hand, help in treating and getting rid of a certain type of acne scars. These fillers are safe and well tolerated, particularly effective for rolling scars and less defined boxcar scars. Derma fillers are classified into three types, temporary, semi-permanent, and permanent. Medical grade silicone can be used for soft tissue augmentation. Number seven, punch excisions. Also known as punch biopsy or subcision, punch excision is a method where all types of facial scars are removed using a small punch tool. They puncture the skin's top layer and create an opening to allow removal of any cyst or pore. Punch excision also treats deep ice pick scars in which the dermatologist makes an excision on your skin, removes the scar, and places a graft over that area. It may leave behind a scar that is less noticeable than the original one. This top acne treatment is recommended for patients having deep pitted scars that are unresponsive to the TCA cross technique. No one asks to have acne scars, right? But having acne is very common and having some scars after is normal too. If you'd like to start fading your scars, try any of the top acne scar treatments mentioned above. If you're ever in doubt, check with your dermatologist to make sure you're picking the best options for your skin type. Hey soldiers, it's Daisy, founder of Banish. Did you like this video? Please give it a thumbs up and comment and subscribe to our channel to be featured with any future Banish acne diaries and skin positivity comment. Thank you, and don't forget, Banished, we got your back. Bye.